Well, good Saturday to everyone. The last Saturday of our November and temperatures right now are feeling mild and pretty comfortable for our Saturday afternoon in the lower 50s, right around 53 degrees. What you'll notice though that it's been overcast for most of our day, but that hasn't kept the temperatures from warming up. And mainly that's because we had this nice south breeze out right around 10 to 15 miles per hour at times today and even gust all the way up into the 20s and 30s. Humidity right around 80%. We're seeing mostly just some cloud coverage with the moisture that is out there right now across portions of uh, the Wabash Valley. We look at some of the other wind totals in the mile per hour right now, and we are seeing that right around 10 to 15 miles per hour, maybe even a little bit stronger than that. But that's all running out of the south, and that will keep on warming us up as we head through the remainder of our Saturday and into tonight even. Storm Team 10 Storm Tracker right here scanning out there and it's not relaying anything as far as some light rain showers or any kind of rain falling to the surface. Although I'm going to leave that chance in there as we head through our Saturday evening and into tonight about a 20 to 30% chance to see just a sprinkle or a drizzle or maybe even a little area of some light rainfall. This is what we're tracking though. That weekend warmth is going to continue as we head into our Sunday. So it's going to feel comfortable as we get into tomorrow to above average temperatures, which is nice. But the rain possibilities continue and then following that the cold air will sink on in and that's going to really cool us off as we get further on into the work week. Here's the big shot though. The clouds are just streaming on through. We couldn't get rid of those for our Saturday. It would have been nice to get the sunshine out there too, but We'll have this flow going in as we continue into our Saturday, maybe breaking up here off to the southwest as we get further on into our Saturday. But embedded in those clouds, we could see a light rain shower, and that's what I was talking about just a few moments ago. We get through the Storm Team 10 futurecast there for a few hours into our Saturday evening and not much going on. We'll continue as we get into right around 1 a.m. and you'll notice some spotty showers starting to pop up through portions of Indiana and stretching through the Midwest and the Hoosier State. And notice this, we get this front that will eventually move on in as we get into our Sunday evening. And that will be our greatest threat to see some rain showers tomorrow and possibly even a thunder shower. I have kept that in there because temperatures are going to be pretty warm up into the 60s. So as we get into our, our evening tomorrow, right around 4 to 8 o'clock, noticing some rainfall starting to pick up, but not very uh, strong and it won't last very long either. That will start to kick out of the region as we get into our late Monday night. All right, so tonight, yeah, 51 degrees. It is not falling much at all. In fact, those temperatures will warm up as we head through the overnight hours. We'll leave that chance for some rain showers in there. Tomorrow, we do have that chance for some uh, showers and even a thunder shower, maybe some uh, rumble of thunder, maybe a bolt of lightning out there, a high of 60 degrees and a gusty south wind running right around 15 to 20 miles per hour. That's what's keeping us warm. But I said the cold air is going to sink in and look at the seven day forecast as early as Monday. Highs in lower 30s, 33 degrees on Monday, and maybe some light snowfalls that lingering moisture hangs around and eventually kicks out of here by Tuesday and Wednesday. Although I do expect some more cloud coverage for our Tuesday. It might be hard to eliminate those clouds as we get into our Tuesday and Wednesday. Temperatures just in the 40s, another bout of rain on Thursday before cloud coverage on Friday. More sunshine, though, returns next weekend on Saturday.